Chuck Rakovich is a football coaching legend in Chippewa Falls, but soon his name will be synonymous with the best in the nation. We learned this week that Rayco is joining the National High School Athletic Coaches Association Hall of Fame. News 18 Sports Director Nick Tabbert caught up with Coach to learn about this latest accolade and the journey it took to get there. Coach, you're entering another Hall of Fame. What does this national honor mean to you? Well, you know, I, I, I really believe that it's, it's not just an honor for me. It's for Chippewa Falls, Chippewa Falls High School, and especially my assistant coaches that have been with me forever, the players that have played underneath me and, and my, my coaches, uh, their parents, their families, as well as the coaches that, that I had when I was growing up. So this is, I'm just a caretaker of this, of this award, seriously. You know, it, 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 one person couldn't do all this. It's everything that comes together. And I've been so fortunate to have support from the kids, the parents, our administration, which is second to none. And, uh, you know, if you, it, when all that lines up, good things happen. You were the youngest head coach in the state of Wisconsin. For two years. For two years. Right. What were you thinking back then when you were first getting started? I went through the interview process over in Crandon. And at, at the time, I was, I was doing odd jobs because I just got out of college. I had no money. You know, and I applied for that job. I borrowed my parents' car to go over for the interview. And, and uh, they called me back later and said, welcome to, to Crandon. And I went home and I talked to my mom and dad and I said, you know, I got a job offer at the cannery to drive truck. I suppose I should do that. And my dad kind of says, son, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Tell me about your coaching philosophy from those early days in Crandon versus now. And what were maybe some of the key things you learned early and how did you implement them here? I've tried to put, put our kids number one, no matter what I do. And uh, everything else falls in place. When did you feel like you really made this program your own? I've never really felt that. I, I feel like it's, like I said, I'm, I'm a caretaker. It's not my own, it belongs to my assistants, uh, uh, the kids that play here, the kids that played for me in the past. I'm just holding on to the thing. Are you glad that you didn't take that truck driving job? Oh man, I'll tell you what. Yeah, it was like four years later, the factory shut down, I'd have been without a job. <laughs> Rakovich will be honored next April in Madison along other Chippewa Valley coaches at the WFCA Hall of Fame Banquet. You can learn how to attend the event by visiting WQOW.com.